Eight candidates have been frequently named as the next Secretary of Agriculture. WCI3's Ag reporter Stu Ellis takes a closer look at four of them from Congress in this morning's reports from the farm. Four of the prominent candidates for Ag Secretary are on the House Agriculture Committee with Central Illinois Congressman Rodney Davis. One of them is Maine Congresswoman Shelley Pingree. Oh, Shelley's great. She would bring a bipartisan perspective and a perspective uh, from, you know, northeastern agriculture. They're really good people, and they're folks that uh, I think could easily walk into the job. Another is Congresswoman Sherry Bustos of northwestern Illinois. I think Sherry's probably the uh, longest shot. Uh, I think that district in a special election would go to a Republican like it almost did during this general election. Uh, Sherry... If she gave that seat up, uh, that would tighten the majority even more so. Another is Cleveland Congresswoman Marsha Fudge. You know, Marsha is a, she's, she's a go-getter. She's an advocate for her constituents and for the issues that she cares about the most. Her and I have worked together on numerous issues on the Ag Committee. We've butted heads on the House Administration Committee, but I think she would be a tireless advocate for... Uh, a tireless advocate for the nutrition side of the uh, agriculture report, uh, Secretary of Agriculture portfolio. A prime candidate would be Ag Committee Chairman Colin Peterson, who lost re-election. Uh, Colin is somebody that I've worked together on bipartisan legislation with throughout my tenure in Congress. I would anticipate a guy like Colin's probably the front runner. I think he's somebody that could immediately step into the job. Uh, Colin knows he's cantankerous and uh, really pushes the issues that are important to him and his constituents. And i got to respect that. That's our report from the farm. I'm Stu Ellis with WCIA 3, your local news leader.